if uh, special forces or troops are in jungle, although the, their GPS systems and the GPS systems in helicopters are very accurate, they still need a precise marker, a precise spot so they can drop their winches to pick up troops from the ground. Okay, so the idea behind this is that it's light enough to be carried in the pack of a soldier. When he gets to his um, pickup point, he opens this and inside we have a balloon. Okay, the balloon is made from mylar. They laid out on the ground, making sure, of course, that there are no thorns or other bits and pieces lying about. You have a line. The line is 200 foot long. Should do that in meters, really, but there we are. This is the lightweight bottle, and it contains helium. This is a filler tube. This is a medical, uh, a medical device. Right? It's a Riles tube. Little dust cap. And this is inserted into the balloon and what we do then is to carefully open the bottle. So in the jungle, you wouldn't have this degree of wind in amongst the trees in the jungle. It does rise vertically. It'll go up 200 feet. It can be seen from seven miles away. Okay? The idea of helium balloons is not new. We could get a design registration on this, but we couldn't, couldn't get a patent. You can put a side of them and stick it onto the side of that so it gives a visible light so it can be seen in the dark. 